Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel and to another Flames of War Battle Report. So, no um, practice games for Nationals this time, so we're just trying some uh, historical stuff. So, uh, as I will mention, I am reading Brothers in Arms, which is a book about the Sherwood Rangers uh, yeomanry in World War II. And I'm um, just re trying to recreate one of their battles in Normandy at Hill uh, Point 103. Uh, against the 12th SS Panzer Division. So um, we're going to use a mission from the D-Day British book uh, using uh, Bocage. Uh, so it should be quite interesting and uh, something a little different. Um, and it's nice to uh, build a formation based on um, something I'm reading about. Okay, so this is the British 100 point list today. So it's a bit different to what I would normally take, but uh, we're doing a nice little kind of a historical uh, matchup today. So my list has two formations. The first one is a Sherman DD Armoured Squadron, which is more or less downgraded to Sherwood Rangers. And the reason I'm using this list is because I'm reading a good book called Brothers in Arms, and it's about the Sherwood Rangers in uh, Normandy and beyond. So, um, I mean, it's in the try out again. So, um, we have a squadron from the Sherwood Rangers with HQ of three DD Sherman tanks, three units of three and they also have three fireflies in their own unit the second formation is a desert rat rifle company because uh, these guys did uh, fight alongside them quite a lot especially in uh, the battles of point 103 and point 102 um these guys are um highlanders so they got bagpipes just so they can rally a bit better so we have a hq of two smg teams and then two full platoons of seven rifle uh, Brangan teams, a Piat and a two-inch mortar, four three-inch mortars, three universal carriers, one with a Piat, three wasps, and two uh, M10 17-pounders, some uh, regimental anti-tank being brought along. And we have a lucky card. So be nice and thematic. So now we'll have a look at the 12th SS Panzer Division. So before we go into the SS, let's go over what makes the Sherwood Rangers the Sherwood Rangers. So basically, each unit gets minus one uh, off the cost. Um, the unit becomes reluctant, but with a remount on a four plus. Um, this is just saying that um, the Sherwood Rangers are veterans from the desert. Um, and basically, fighting in the desert and fighting in Normandy are two rather different theatres of combat and um, the tank crews really struggled um, to cope, um, especially since they couldn't really see anything, and if they tried to see something, the commander would get shot. So um, they lost quite a lot of uh, tank commanders uh, quite quickly, and obviously only needed a Panzerfaust in a hedge or bocage, and uh, you end up getting taken out. So basically, um, if they could bail out and just get away, then it would be a smart thing to do since they've been fighting for quite a few years already. So um, there we go, the Sherwood Rangers. Now we have the 12th SS. So we have a um, Panzer Grenadier Company. So this list is going to be more defensive um, while the Sherwood Rangers are on the attack in this case. So we have the formation here. We have a HQ of two SMG teams. We then have two full Panzer Grenadier platoons, so seven MG teams uh, with Panzerfausts. Um, they are upgraded to the 12th Hitlerjugend SS Panzer Division Schnell. Um, it doesn't really give a match for two points. It just basically, um, they follow me on a two plus, but they can still shoot, uh, just keeping it um, um, as it like, you know, thematic for um, the mission. Uh, we also have four um, machine guns, and these are down uh, in machine gun nests. We have th four 8cm mortars, three pack 40s and four uh, heavy 12cm mortars. In support, we have a uh, 250 scout troop, so that's two with cannons, one with MG. We then have, make sure I get it right, Jagd Panzer, Panzer IVs. And I've equipped them with Rudolf Roy, who is um, part of the 12th SS, at least um, I got him down as. And basically, these, these are kind of Stug stats. Um, it's 811 gun, front armor 7, 
Um, but um, this guy, um, he gets to re-roll one fail roll to hit each time he shoots with his 7.5 centimeter gun. And this unit gains scout, so quite handy. We also have two heavy 8.8 centimeters and three SS Panthers. So these are from the D-Day book, keeping it the same. And it would be nice to give him front armor 10. But that is it. So um should be a fun little game. We're using a mission from the British D-Day book, which we'll have a look at next. Okay, so if you're lucky enough to have the D-Day British book, you will be able to see this mission yourself and maybe have a chance to play it. Um, so it is a decent mission. So basically the British will be attacking in this uh, instance with the uh, 12th SS defending. Um, it could be vice versa because there was plenty of counterattacks going back and forth. Um, but uh, play it as you want, but make sure you get plenty of package. So um, it'll mix things up. What we did as a rule, um, there are some hills which is representing the British coming down from the high ground into the town and um, basically um, they can see over the bocage because uh, from uh, eyesight you can see it but if a unit is up right next to the bocage it can't be seen which is kind of different to um, how tall terrain works but that's how we're going to play it so if you're going to do some house rules I suggest you uh, let your opponent know and you stay consistent to it so it's fun for everyone. So today's table, I, I honestly tried to get it uh, a square overhead shot and it seems I do it on the day, but when uh, I come to upload it, it is a bit askew. So difference about this, it is a four by four table. So there are those um, walls at the back are representing um, the edge of that table. So I'll be attacking from the right, from the high ground. You can see I got my Shermans mixed around. The HQ is down the bottom with one troop. Um, we have some M10s on the hill. Um, and we have some more Shermans on the hill as well. And then up to the top, we have the Fireflies and another unit of um, Sherman. So we have one unit of infantry going into the woods and another unit with a HQ further up. And then we have the Universal Carrier Contingent on uh, the side of the hill. So the Germans have machine gun nests, which is scattered around. We have one platoon holding one objective uh, by the house and then another one up in the wheat field. So we're using the themed objectives. So might be a bit difficult to tell. So there's one on the road and then there's one in the top in the corner of the top field to the left bottom corner of that field. And then there's a platoon in the HQ hold in the top one with the 12 centimeter mortars behind, eight centimeter mortars more middle of the table. 88s are by the trees towards the middle uh, of the table on the left with the pack 40s in reserve. So in re reserve, um, sorry, pack 40s in ambush. In reserve, we have the Panthers and the Yag Panther, panzers. So there's a link in description uh, that will take you straight to, to Firestorm Games. So if you're looking to collect a new army or bolster an existing one, Firestorm Games are the place for you. So they do bulk share, bolt action, team yanking, and flames of war, as well as all the supplies you'll need as well. So by using my link, you'll help me in my channel. And by using Firestorm Games, uh, they have excellent discount across their range and they're fast and reliable and have excellent customer service. Doing one British movement. These humans are pushing forward, HQ and one platoon. He's got stuck in the hedge, these guys just made it up. Stay in put. He's got no um These Shermans are crossed through the woods. This unit's moving through the woods. Everything's moving. Only shooting they're gonna be doing is a smoke barrage with the three inch mortars. It's gonna be sweeping in front there. And I get it. And that would that's gonna be my shooting. Because everything else is crossed. Always behind the smoke barrage. So can't see anything. Well, I suppose I can I can shoot down there if I can hit anything. Nah. Uh, these guys could shoot down there. Uh, I'll measure up and yeah, might as well do that. 17 pounders are going to fire at the infantry. So you hit on. No, they don't. So threes normally, fours because you're concealed, fives because you've gone the ground, six for the range, and seven for HE. So there's a chance. No. Do you need for seven, six, and five? Six and a five, and an eight is a six and a six. Um, that is my turn. 
We're done. So start of your turn, motivations. No motivations has got hit. So and that goes. Um, are you going to bring in your amber? So it goes in your deployment. No, no, no. It's, it, it, it ends there and ends there. So it's only there. Well, I might try and get to, if I oh, can my ADA hit those now? No, they won't be able to hit them because of the other cars. Four inches away. Four inches. But they have to be in your deployment zone. So uh, there's going to be no movement from the SS, but we do have this nice little ambush. So it's six shots. You are hitting me on fives because there is concealing train. Oh, you can roll them in here. So one hit. So 80, 12. My front arm is six. So if I roll a six, it will equal. So you can bail me. Well, and then sorry, and, and sorry everyone. Yeah, but I can't really do anything there now. But uh, yeah, sorry, I brought the wrong dice, so lose some para paratrooper stuff. So that is British turn two. So we're on turn two now. Um, only motivation is to smoke ghosts. Only motivation is to remount. They remount on a four. On a four plus. Which he does. And then I have to have a little think of what I'm actually going to do. So. Movement. British movement in two. Uh, Lee Sherman's managed to skirt past the mines to go to the flank of the back 40. He's still got stuck. Um, these, one of the HQ tanks has moved. These did cross here to get to the forest. The infantry here, two guys moved into the minefield, one triggered it, hence they pinned and he died. And then we got stuff moving. And a wasp managed to get through a hedge. And there we go. So shooting. Uh, I think we're going to be putting a template spotted from by the hill going into that nice little wheat field. I think it looks like a good, uh, good place to go. So HQ unit is going to fire into your pack 40s, main guns. Um, so threes normally, fours because you're concealed. Uh, I've got five hits. What? Yeah, two, two, and one. So you can swap the double up if you want. So, do you want to swap? So it's two on him. Okay, so we have, so it's two. So it, where, where, where would you like the one? On the middle one. Okay, cool. So I can keep going and As soon as you fail, you can't do it anymore. Just when you're waiting that order mark, that it can't not be. No, then you can swap it off him. Um, so two saves on him on a three. Chance to kill. He's okay. The guy in the middle went, just went for him. He's dead. And then two on the end. He's dead. dead. So I don't, they don't count as my losses because they're your fault. Yeah, that, that is that is, a, that is true. Okay then. So the other unit. So we got this guy here and this guy here. Um, I think they they're gonna fire into the remaining pack forty. So uh, again, so three is normally four for concealment. Ah, of course. Shit. Uh, these guys are going to fire at the pack 40, so um, three hits normally, force concealment, five to range, six, because there's no HG. -E. No. Um, so over to here, the wasps. So these two are going to fire into him. I got my, left my cards over there. So you got six shots, three's normally, four's concealed, five's gone to ground. Two. So you've got two saves, but you have to re-roll your successfuls because it's a flamethrower. So you re-roll in them, and he's dead. Because normally I have to re-roll my firepower, but flamethrower is auto firepower. Oh, yeah. Okay. The other three 
uh, he can only target them two. And that's one hit. So, yeah, I'll have a look on him. So, double save. Dead. And the unit's pins with a flame attack as well. He is... The universal carriers will fire into your infantry, so three, four, five needed. Uh, two, so the one right in front of them and your unit leader. Can I swap it to him? Yeah, yeah, you can. it's close enough. Uh, two, yeah. So two saves on the front, guys. Yeah. Right knee. Yeah. Right, infantry, the first four teams can fire, and the Piat and the two inch mortar. So the first four get three hits, the Piat and the mortar miss. So just three saves. So the closest three. Alright, try and swap him over to that one. Okay. Yeah. yeah. So left, middle, and right. Left, middle, and right. I need a six to kill him. No. It doesn't matter what you're Um. Yes, yeah. We'll need a shield. My fireflies on the hill are going to fire at the scout cars. We're saying because these two are right up to the bocage, I can't see them. Uh, it's just the high ground. So threes normally, um, it'd be fours for range because you will get concealment. Yes, but that won't make any difference. There's two, and there'll be no save. Uh, he's bailed. I'll have two shots down into him. Uh, if it's within 16 inches, it's, it is a hit. Can he shoot through Just, no man? It was two. Yeah, so one safe. No, he's okay. And. That is. Uh, there will be assaults. So I think I will assault there because you won't be able to Faust because you've got your own guy in the way. Well, well, this guy might be because he's going to go basically there and there. Well, I'll just assault with him so he can't fire and you don't get a Faust either. But I need to see if I get to the hedge, which I do, and four will kill you. No. So now you get the counter attack. So I don't get any defensive fire, do I? No, it's because it, you're forward firing and the gun the gun will block. You can't shoot through your own unit. If it's a gun. If it was an infantry team, yes. So, uh, one dice. So they counter. Success have gone in. So roll for the gun first to see if he hits. One dice for the gun. That's going to be a miss. Now, which infantry would you like to have a Faust? Only one for D Day, two later on. Yeah. So, yeah, so for him, hits, and the other guy, hits. So, uh, this, this one I can actually save, it saves. What's the AT on uh, Faust? It should just go straight through, I think. 12. That goes through. So, five plus it will kill. Nope, so he just bails. So I think I have to counter attack, otherwise, I, I, I have no way because I, I have to go away. So I think they, I'll lose a unit apart from that guy. They are reluctant though. So whether they use a lucky card is a question. Um, um, I don't think it's worth using a lucky card. Or is it? Because it's a five. So no, unfortunately that is a unit dead. And we have a second assault going in here and we'll see what happens. Okay, so in the end the SS won down to three rifle teams in that platoon and the SS are down to three because I lost two into defensive fire and I had one really bad turn in as a counter attack with three guys rolled twos even with my lucky re-roll so yeah awful so turn two for the SS you've got a pinned unit 
who will get a re-roll because of the HQ. So first attempt? No. No, no, so they stay pinned. And the pack 40 is a la- is needs to... Does he end pin with the... No, he He's pinned because yeah. I got five hits on them, I didn't yes, yes. So rally? No. no. And then last down. Yes. yes. So make sure we'll put a pin marker on him. So check that next so to him. Five, yeah. And I don't think anything else was in trouble. Oh, oh, I got a remount on your scout car. Have uh, you remembered all these? Uh, no. Oh no, yeah, fearless. So he's back in. Okay, so we continue into SS movement, if there's going to be any. I did have movement from the SS. These guys, he just pushed up so I can't see him, but you want to range in, don't you? Yeah. So the 12 centimetre mortars that are veteran, and the HQ, which is also veteran, is going to spot and you just want it right there. So you got it, you got it. So we'll see what damage you make. So the Germans got a hit, a hit, and a hit here. Failed my save, but it failed firepower, and a bounce, and a bounce. Yeah, you can keep them going on the ground if you want. Yeah. Can that shoot that one against the lead HMG do anything against that one? You can, because it's anti tank uh, two, you can potentially bail it. So you'll have six shots hitting me on five. Might as well make use of One. So as long as I don't roll a one, famous last words, it's okay. Uh, the eight centimetre mortars used the last two attempts. To try and range in the actually roll one more the two I see he's also got a attempt um, so yeah you see that final attempt so you hit me on sixes so this is with the eight centimeter mortars so uh, that guy no middle guy no that guy no and the UCs so top middle what do I need five six because it's final attempt. Okay, back 40 going for my remaining yeah. tank. Uh, one, it'll just the one because you can. Yeah. No. Uh, 88 still can't see anything, so that's it. Because your infantry can go to ground, so it's harder for me to hit yeah. you. Do you want to cope with someone? Uh, no, I'm good, thanks. Do you want to see me do my motivation so you know I'm not cheating? Oh, yeah. Yeah? Yeah, I'll stay viewers. Right, Vos- uh, Wasp to get back in. I, I just moved that to a five, yeah, so he's back. He's <laughs> book- no, I'm good, thank you. Uh, rally the infantry. They do. They need Highlanders for that. Now, these knights need a rally. Nope. And last stand on the Shimmer. No. The British movement, my universal carrier contingent is moving through the fields with the infantry pushing up. Exploiting the gaps in the barrage. The Germans have moved around to here. Five place stay in put. These infantry are pinned, so I'm going to try and dig them in, which they don't. Uh, HQ is staying put. These Germans have moved around to assault into him because they can. Might as well. Um, and that's it. So we will go into shooting. Shooting wise, my HQ is going to spot for the um, mortars. I'm going to be putting it about here. So he can't fire, but the rest of the unit can. So it's going to be a five because he's only trained. So he's, he always used the worst skill route in. Got it. So I'm hitting you on five. So if I get my marker wherever I put it. Okay, so I ranged in, but it's going to be five to hit you. So the pack 40 is missed, and then it's four rifle teams. I get two of them. So two saves. Good, but they're pinned. I just, you just know it's there. What an And then four shots into the pack. Uh, that's two hits. Two saves. Yes. I'm just saying that I should learn it. Three plus. Three plus. Where's cock? Where's cock? What? There's angles on the hedge. You've done that. Side skirting. They took you drifting. Yeah. Hey, he's dead. Well, 
It's a true gentleman player. Of course I am. I'm not giving you any lee room. I know you're a competent player. Well, some people say. Three shots into him. Uh, one hit. He's okay. These failed to dig in. These two are going to go at them. Um, sevens. Nope. Um, fireflies will go to ground up there. UCs are going to go into your HQ. So it's going to be five. So first three, get one hit. Second. It's a hit. And then a final one. There's only one I can draw line of sight on. Right. Three saves on him. Can I put him on any? No, that's the two I see. You can swap it onto the platoon. No, no. Okay. Go on uh, on this, on the two I see. Yeah, I, I doubt I'll get Let's it. Let's put it in the box to save losing friendship. Who are friends, really? No. <laughs> those, are, those are my dice. Oh, okay. No, that doesn't count. Doing perfectly. That doesn't count. Oh. Oh. Outrageous. Right, the wasps. Your membership's down to six now. I'm telling my mum to drop off as well. Right, well, well, I can't delete all my accounts though, can I? So, two of them can only hit that guy closest to me, and the other guy... I'm not charging you for No, no, I'm flaming you. So the first six... Guess one hit, and then the other... There's a lot of twos and ones. Guess two hits on the unit leader. So, the guy... He's, two, he's only four inch range. Yeah. Oh, check, check, check. He's within four. That's bugger, isn't it? Yeah. He's within four. Okay, so everyone's got one hit. So the guy closest to you, to double save. Double yeah. save. Yeah. He's a slave to her. Dead. Middle guy. With a reroll. He's okay. And then the guy closest to me. Dead. So it's just the unit leader left. Brave, 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 hit, brave, hit, brave, hit, brave hit, they use. Infantry, first three teams, guess one hit on your unit leader. Okay, uh, Sherman's can't see him. Yeah, yeah, he's pinned. Yeah, yeah, he's pinned. Um, may, may I actually assault him with my boys since should be. You watch now, you'll, I'll lose both of them. Um, two fireflies will shoot at your HQ. Um, it's going to be long range, concealed, go on the ground, so like sixes, two shots. That's not going to be a six. <gasps> Rod. Yeah! I figured out how the roll six is. One save. He should be fine. He isn't. No, he's not. But you still, you, he is alive. He just swaps over, so he's dead. Yeah, the position change. Gosh, nice game this is so far. Um, shooting is done. So I'll do my assaults and we'll start up there. So two guys went in, one got shot in the head, but the unit leader on unit leader and there was no need to counterattack for the SS because uh, he killed that Hitler youth boy. He really showed him British steel. Um, but I am debating whether to do that assault. Um, I don't think it's a good idea. No, keep him, keep him there. Um, I'm not going to assault with them. Okay. So, SS turn three. Uh, you got a rally test on your infantry, which they pass, and you have one dice, one dice for reserves. So do you know what you need? Five. A five. The spin on it. It works. No. Didn't work like you. Okay. So we'll come back after SS movement. German movement. The scout cars have moved to um, contest the objective more. Uh, the 8 centimeter mortars of uh, terrain dashed over to also support and as it's a German movement. So shooting, you say you wanted to range in. Yeah, that's... 
No. But you can't. You have to be outside of four of him. But yeah, you should still get. I'll tell you what, if you just put it there, you'll get all of that. Right, final range No. Nope. Ah, two. No. Would you believe it? Yeah, so that's gone. Okay. Uh, um, eight centimetre mortars are moved. At the same time, I'm going to be so it's just the uh, 20 mils in there. Well, you've got machine guns if you wanted yeah. to fire it. They're not dug in or anything, are they? No, no, no. So you have uh, three each. So there'll be nine shots on fives. Come on. Have a father down there. One each. One dice. Oh, well, they're definitely last standing now. Um, your MG Ness can see that guy. How many shots? Five? Yeah. Six. Oh! Look at that! He's okay. Oh, actually. Oh, actually, you might you might actually kill him with that. Oh, no, bail him, sorry. Because it's sight are equal. I hope your sorry. viewers are, uh, are recognising this. Recognising what? This spending of a rule system. Well, rule book's flexible, isn't it? <laughs> it really could go like that. Um, so what's that? That's buggered out. He's nothing. nothing. Because you, you could have bailed him. Because it's side zero, I rolled a two, yeah. equals six with a bail. We well, need a six on an HMG, don't you? Know, yeah, five. it's only small arms. You can check if you like. No, no, no. no. Firepower six. Yeah. Uh, is that it for you? I think it is. Oh, can I do some schnell moving? The um, mortars might be able to. Mo yeah, moving four inches, the unit leader. Yeah. Um, he is okay. Oh, no, no, don't, don't move him yet. And I'll roll one dice. On a two up, you can do it because because a twelfth SS. Yeah, so they can do it. So they can all. Before I do my shooting, I'll just touch base. No, absolutely. Highly unconventional. All right, so we're going to British turn four. Uh, I have a rally test on my infantry in the woods, which don't rally. I try and dig them in. They don't. And then I have a last stand. Sorry, he runs away. So, do you know if you committed your C and C to that? I could. Uh, yeah, I can put him into the assault as well. Yeah. Fish movement. Um, wasps have moved so they can only hit the HQ. These haven't moved. These guys have crossed through. I'm going to try and dig in the HQ while I'm here, uh, which I don't. Uh, these Shermans uh, crossed. No, they did a cross here and went over. I didn't do a cross here with them and then them got over and the M10s had done a terrain and a follow me. So that is that. So I'm going to start with trying to cup your HQ. So this will be hitting you on fives. He has got five saves to make re-rolling successfuls. So first five, he's dead. The UCs are going to go into your uh, eight centimetre mortars, so it's hitting you on fours. So the way it will work, it will go one, one, I don't think I can see him. He will get bulletproof cover. That guy won't. No, he will. There's not that much of a gap. In fact, I don't think you think there's meant to be a gap, so I can't see him. So it'll be like that. So three saves on him. Three, you six hits, right? Uh, threes. He dies. And then the other guy has got three saves. Uh, I need a six. Yeah. And the Shermans are going to fire on your scout cars. So you did fire them, so it's going to be fours to hit. Yeah. And we're still playing it, so because they're like tucked up against it, these can't see, but they can because 
they're right next to it. And then my three Shermans over there are just going to blast into infantry. Uh, that's nothing. And then my eight centimetre mortars are just going to repeat their bombardment. So it's hitting you on fours. Three, sorry. In fact, I think it's going to be fours because my HQ fired. So three saves. Re rolling successful because it's a repeat. That doesn't matter. Three of them. Where's the empire? <laughs> okay, um, we're turn four SS. We have a rally test on the mortars. Yes. That rally. And a rally test on the infantry. Oh, a rally. They love combat. The mortars will need to do a last stand because there's only two of them left. No, but run. Here, troops, no doubt. And you have two dice for reserves. Come on, I think this is for the game, isn't it? Could be. Ah, no. Uh, no, I still, I don't think I have enough to get you off the objective. So we'll come back after German movement. Do you want to do them last? Motors. Do, do the motors last, see what happens. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so scout cars are going to the flamer and the H, the, the unit, the machine gun's going into my HQ, yeah? Okay. So three shots on sixes for him. Oh! That's a hit. Three, uh, so three up save. Survives. And then you got your six cannons into them. Auto That'd cannons be... into flamers. On five. Oh, that's so not bad. Hit on all of them. One each. Um, they're 85, so I need fours to equal. So the guy on the objective. No, the middle guy, the other guy. So one chance to kill. Come on, for the far to land. Fail. <laughs> Right, so just check. Right. So put, uh, check our next one then. Please. They can they can contest, can't they? Uh, What's that? They can contest. They're not some kind because of he's bailed out. I have to get him back in. Yeah. So the twelve centimeter mortars won't hurt my Shermans. Oh, right. Okay. But they can kill the HQ if you wanted to. Nah. Bear in mind, one more unit and it's a minor victory for me. If you kill it. Yeah. Go on, I put him on there. I put him on there. Okay. Uh, be a four because of the terrain. Mm -hmm. Yes. Right, so the guy who's bailed out is hit on a five. No, and the other two. Right. Chance to kill. That's a kill. Okay, so the scouts are going to shoot and scoot. No, they still there. Right. British turn. I don't think, I don't think they're going to survive another turn. Could do with them rallying, would be yeah. nice. Uh, remount on the wasp. I don't think that's going to be enough. Uh, nope. So they have to last stand. No, they're gone. So the guy, he dies and he drives away. A rally test on the infantry. They finally rally. <laughs> and I didn't even... <laughs> the bagpipes are gone. <laughs> Movement. My HQ's finally got off the hedge, going this way because I can assault him. Uh, these guys who have finally rallied, cleared the minefield, and then the rest are moving. I'm going to have to assault him, otherwise he's just going to shoot me. And these Shermans have moved to shoot at the scout cars. These Shermans have moved also to shoot the scout cars. And UCs are pushed up, and HQ has pushed up. So shooting. I'm going to start with... These guys are just going to blast, blast away. So he's going to have not anyone to shoot at, so it's just going to be four shots hitting you, eight shots hitting you on fives. So hitting you on fives. <laughs> I have some spectacular rolling today. So two shots and there will be a two inch mortar. So miss, two inch mortar, that's also a miss. Shermans into the scout cars. 
Uh, two hits, so you want it on the cannons, please. I think four, though. They're threes. And I say fours. Go to the right. When we're looking for aggressive. Yeah. So you. There's no save. Wonderful, there's a save. No, 80-10. So cannon furthest away. Cocked. Dead. Dead. Uh, not him. He's the only one I didn't shoot. I shot those two. You can, you can swap it onto him if you, you know. Oh, these are nice. Use the fancy smoke. The... Sorry, Rob, which ones have gone now? That one? Uh, those two. But you have a reserve coming in at least next turn, so it's not that good. These guys, Piat's gonna fire. Nah, Shermans are gonna fire. So two can see him. The other one's just gonna go for the... 12 centimeter on the objective. So into the scout car, into the 12 centimeter, hit the 12 centimeter. So, Mordor? You can swap. Oh, you yeah. can swap to the other guy. Yeah. He does save on a four. Yeah, um, save. UCs are going to go on to go to ground. My mortars are going to range in on the 12 centimeters. Got it. So the three who are not on the objective, two are hit. So both champs, uh, both okay, and then the one on the objective is hit. She's okay. I'm ranged in down the road now. And they're pinned. And for a laugh, I'm just going to do an assault. <laughs> for a laugh. So you're hitting on a five because of the terrain, but you're not pinned. So one one shot with a faust. Come on. No. Two swings. He's dead. Come back. Counter attack. <laughs> You do? Yeah. So he's the only one who can get in. What about that bastard? He's too far away. He should be. Yeah. So swing away. So this has a, this is a panther house. Yep. So that's a bail. But you might kill him. You do? So I have to counter attack. I don't, so I back away. You've got six defensive fire shots. Um, and they'll be at me on fours. So, four, so first guy survives, next guy dies. Swing, fail, so you need a counter. I dies, because he can't move. And then my guys get to move four inches. So, um, oh, you get to move him four inches, so you can go into the foxhole where they okay. So they need to rally, because they took a hit in assault, so they do. The 12 centimeter mortars need to rally. They don't. The scout car needs to do a last stand, which is a pass. And then you've got four dice for reserves. And if you fail all of them, you get one. You get both. Here they come. German movement. They've come on. Uh, Rudolf Roy, isn't it? In the middle, yeah. Yeah, Rudolf Roy in the middle. Panthers have come on, and the scout car just moved away to just make room. Um, so this MG, six shots hitting on fours, because um, I don't have concealment. Two hits. I'm going to try and swap it into the guys who are in bulletproof cover because of the bocage. Nope. So save there, save there. Oh, love it. They love it. So we're next to the fire end. So if they're pinned, can't, they can't, can't barrage. They can't barrage and they can't do any direct fire. Manage. They have no direct fire. Never mind, they're doing their job. Right, so. Do you want to do your MGs into the HQ? Yeah. Three shots. Three shots on five. Two. Two. So one is in bulletproof cover because of the wasp. So one isn't and the one is. They're okay. 
Right, and then who's firing first out of this lot? Um, I put the two squaddies. Just roll three, but you get to re-roll one. Because, because yeah, you just get to re-roll one. Ah. So you get to re-roll one of them. Two hits. So it's 80, 11, isn't it? So I can't stop that. So two firepowers. Ah. Two. But that might be enough. That may well be enough. I don't think so. It could be. And then you've got the Panthers. Who are they fighting now? Two that way. Oh, yep. they got covered there, haven't they? So, he, he won't. All right. But he will. Yeah. Oh, is that how you want the hits? You can. Right, one on the removable way. No, the one in the cover. That's a miss. And you've got one left. Into him. Okay. Uh, on a five. Oh, hit. I can't stop that. So, three to kill. Yeah, dead. So, we got another kill. <laughs> Remounting my Sherman. Right, one got back in uh, as it lies because kind of needed that. But these, those turrets, do they move? No. Oh well, that's bad. I just put it like that. So yeah, we, we, they fight. They pointing down there, so we, we swing them. I should oh, get like little matches. He, or he or is still over there. Failed out. Okay. Right. Movement. Uh, British movement. Uh, he's moved back just so he can shoot down there. These haven't moved. These haven't moved. HQ's moved up in the hope something happens over here. These humans haven't moved. M10's tried to cross, uh, but failed, but they can still see the end panther, which is good because that's the only one, one of the few ones they can't see. Um, so that's that. So I'm going to start with shooting down here into them. That's two hits. So it's only going to be on him. Ah! You guys. So that's another unit last standing, thankfully. Okay. And I'm going to be danger close there. So I'm going to pop it right in the corner just to clip the last three mortars. Uh, got on the final attempt. So, uh, so closest to you, middle, other guy, scout car. Got the scout car. I, I, I can't really do much. good. I can bail it. No. Right. The fireflies on the hill. I can only see the middle panther. So that's going to be threes, fours. That's four hits. Your armor goes to ten for the range. Just nine goes to ten. I'm at tank fourteen. So you need fours to equal. On how many dice? Four. What? So two cha chances. So two chances to bail you. Yeah, you're bailed. So that's middle tank. The two M10s, it's going to be threes, fours, fives. I, they miss. The Piaf can only hit him, and it's a 50 50 I hit him. And then the other UCs are going to go into the mortar on the objective. So the Piaf gets a hit. So who do you want to randomise, me or you? One, two, three is the turret. So turret. So your side armor is on a panther. Push the card across. Five. So you need a five to equal. He's bailed. I blew up. I blew up those two sounds. And then the other shots into the twelve centimeters. Uh, so one more hit. No? Okay. That's okay. No, that's Alright. What are you putting me to do, bro? These two Shermans. Um, so he can target him and he can target him. So into him. 
That's one hit. And the other guy who can hit both misses. So again, randomization. It's the the turret, so you need a five people. Six. He is dead. So these are gonna fire next. So he's got an open shot onto the yep. bailed out and he is gonna be concealed. So he's gonna be on fours and the other guy's on threes. So two hits. So it's on both of them. So first of all, one, two, three terra on the middle guy. It's the hull. So it's gonna be five equal. So a five to equal. Ten. Uh, he's double bailed, so you need to do a remount. So because he's double bailed, you yeah. need to see if he does a remount. He's dead. And then the other guy is probably long range. No luck. Where are you going to be? Which one? No. It's going to be the furthest back because I got two hits. And he actually hit him. Yes, because basically, because I got two hits, he's within six to allocate the hit to. So measure 16 inches from these guys, if, if it's in short. Yeah. Yeah. So again, it'd be a five to equal. Uh, he's dead. I got, I got more orange. All the Panthers are gone, so the HQ is going in. So you don't get defensive fire from the mortars, yeah. which I think they should have at least. Yeah, rifles, isn't it? Yeah. So two swings. Kills. So the thing is now we need to see if you're within four. You can't move towards me. So any of them within four of my HQ. Don't so. Of my of my HQ. Know. You oh your HQ? Yes. So you roll the counter. Now it might be a different counter attack rating on the heavy mortars. Aggressive three. Um, motivation. Fearless three. Oh right. So they don't move, but I have to counter attack, which I pass. So going for I have to. So one will go for each. So swing up there. Swing up there, and yeah, that would be game. Cool. All right. Thank you very much. Right, I have to pick an MVP for you. I have to pick an MVP for for you. Um, the Panthers did well. Well, not so much. Um, probably this platoon. This this hit the youth platoon by here because. They got rid of a lot. MVP for me. Ooh. It's got to be the wasps. Yeah, it's got to be the wasps. Definitely. They were good. Yeah, they cooked yeah, a lot of people. But you've got me down to 6 3 victory. Not bad.